Cryogenics. The word brings to mind images of famous cartoonists being preserved for future reanimation. But cryotechnicians with the 379th Expeditionary Logistics Readiness Squadron have a much more practical and realistic use for the liquid oxygen and nitrogen that they supply. We supply the aviators breathing oxygen to them, and then we also are the uh, sole hub within the AOR to ship cryogenics to uh, a lot of fobs so that they can launch the aircraft that they have at their installation. Being the only provider of over 10,000 gallons of liquid oxygen for pilots as well as medical transports, along with liquid nitrogen for aircraft tires and fire extinguishers, Al Udeed's cryo team has a huge responsibility in the region. I mean, without it, in reality, the mission can't go forward. A aircraft aren't going to launch. Uh, a lot of people can say that, but I, they can't go anywhere. They can't, they can't launch off the ground because the crews can't survive once they get in altitude without aviators breathing oxygen. If you are ever on a C-17 or a C-130 leaving Al Udeed, Bagram, or Herat, just to name a few, then the air you're breathing was put there by the cryogenics team at Al Udeed. Reporting from Al Udeed Air Base, I'm Air Force Staff Sergeant Dustin Roberts.